This video is going to show you how to use Peak LE6 or Peak Pro 6 to remove the vocals or center channel from a stereo file. Now, the best way to do this would be to remix the song with the vocals muted, but since that probably isn't an option, you can use this technique to fake it. It works to varying degrees. The sample I'm using is a song by Frobeck from their latest album, Other Side of the Light. Let's hear a little bit of the, uh, the first verse here to hear how the vocals sit with the song. Now the first step is to select either the left or the right side. I use the right side. Once you do that, then go to the DSP menu and choose Invert. Inverting will reverse the polarity of the selected audio. It's kind of like flipping it upside down. Now we go back to the DSP menu and choose Stereo to Mono. Leave the pan in the center. Since the right side was inverted, combining the two sides will cancel everything they have in common, which is everything down in the center. Now the resulted file is definitely missing the vocals, although you can still hear the reverb tail a little bit. Let's go ahead and hear it. Since the volume is still quite a bit low, I will use the normalize feature to raise it back up. Now if you need a stereo file, you can always just use the mono to stereo command before saving the file. And there you go. This technique works to varying degrees depending on how the source material was mixed. If the vocals are not placed in the center of the stereo field, they will not be completely removed without further adjustment of the left-right balance. Also, like in the example I used, if there are effects like reverb on the vocals, the effects will remain audible since the reverb is a series of short delays that vary on either side. This makes it impossible to remove. Further processing such as EQ and compression could be used to even it out. 